Up until now, we've marveled over the life of David. His unrelenting faith in God seemed unshakable. His ability to apply the promises and sovereignty of God into every decision he made was remarkable. But in chapter 27, we begin to see his faith waver. Time after time, although God delivered David from Saul's hand, and after so many close calls, David succumbed to the fear of the statistical probabilities that Saul could kill him. He started looking at God's favor as a mere good luck charm that could one day run out. But God and his promises are far greater than statistics or fortune. God's promises never fail. And here, for a very dark season in David's life, he begins to make decisions without seeking God, thereby setting himself on a path of raiding, stealing, deceiving, and even killing. But let this be a reminder for us that our heroes, the men and women of faith that we look up to, are human after all. And none of us are exempt from the grip that fear can have on us. But there is some good news. As we will see, even our bad decisions, moral failures, and lack of faith cannot mess up the promises of God. One of my favorite reminders of this is found in 2 Timothy 2.13. If we are unfaithful, God remains faithful, for he cannot deny who he is.